<clears throat> hey guys and welcome back to my channel if you're new my name's marie and today's video is something a little bit different it's basically a story time about how i fell off the treadmill But before I get into the story time, if you haven't already, please, 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 could you subscribe and also um, like, comment, share. I would really, really appreciate it. Um, so let's get into the story time. This happened when I was still in sixth form, so around five years ago. It was when the new iPhone 5S just came out. So I copped it within a week. So i was so gassed it was my first ever iphone um i just looked after it like a baby i had the i had the screen protector i had the case just nothing was gonna hurt that phone at all um so i was in the gym and i was on the treadmill and i put my phone where you can put your phone keys water bottle um all of that and I also had my headphones in, so I was just running, just enjoying the gym session. And then, I don't know what happened, but my phone fell. And in my head, I'm just thinking, bro, do you know how expensive that phone is? Like, go and collect your phone. Um, but I just stopped running. I don't know why, but I just stopped running. And um, yeah, I flew. Not even fat, I flew, my feet went <laughs> My feet weren't touching the floor. So, yeah, I was on the floor. But in my head, I was just thinking, Marie, you're not a dickhead. Your mum did not carry you for nine months for you to fall off the treadmill. So I was just hyping myself up in my head. So I just grabbed my phone. I was like, yeah, 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 yeah. Are you dumb? You think you could take me in for a dickhead? No, this is me talking to the treadmill. <laughs> this is me talking to the treadmill. I was like, you think you're bad? You think you could bat me up like that? You think you could push me over like that? Who do you think you are? So I just got back on the treadmill thinking you're not going to get taken for a dickhead. But because I have this so overly hyped, I didn't press stop. So the treadmill was still running. <laughs> so this time when I stepped on the treadmill, yeah, it took my feet away. As in I roly polyed. Was it? I fell. Boom. Like, slapped it slapped it rolled and then fell as into the point i think i still have it um that cut right there is from the treadmill because your good sis literally rolled like that and fell so yeah i'm scarred for life the second one humbled me i just sat on the floor thinking marie 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 I'm sure you have talent. I am sure you have talent. But where this talent is taking me, I don't know. I don't know. F is wrong with me. I'm sure I have talent. But we are my talent. Because really, I'm actually a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. I'm a dumbass. Why did I not stop the treadmill? <laughs> I actually deserved the second one. I deserved it. Because are you dumb? Stupid. Stupid. The second one was really bad. The whole gym. It was a small gym though. But yeah, the whole gym stopped their workout to come and help me. You know when something embarrassing happens and in your head you're, you're thinking, no, nah, did that really happen? And then when people come and actually help you, it just confirms that I did. And I'm really just thinking, go away, man. Like, leave me alone to just be embarrassed in peace. But obviously everyone's just helping me. It's asking are you okay are you hurt and bro the only thing hurt was my pride like do you know how embarrassing that is well like, I, I was just trying to find that uh-huh <laughs> um <laughs> yo da that is awful so i just had to just get myself back up and i got back on the trip this time i stopped it uh-huh Aha. In my old gym, there was like a massive glass in front of the treadmills you can see outside. So I'm just looking deep in my life. And then the lady next to me just turned around. She was like, um, I think you should go home, sweetie. And I just turned around and I was like, 
yeah so I just grabbed my stuff and I went home and um, it was only like a five ten minute walk to my house but I was just deep in Marie you didn't fall off the treadmill once you had twice twice who does that who does that oh my gosh so I was just really deep in it on the way home I, how are you even going to show your face in the gym again because the treadmill really done its job for me the channel done its job on you. It's now scarred you for life. How can you show face? And then I get home and my mum asks, how was the gym? And I'm just, I was just like, and I just like crying. <laughs> I know my mum was thinking, are you normal? Are you, are you normal? I, 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 are you normal? <laughs> Are you normal? Like, what is wrong with this girl? But she just gave me a hug. So I'm standing in the middle of the kitchen crying. My mum's hugging me. Um, I'm just like, I fell off the treadmill. I've got a big laugh. I've got a big And then because I was crying so much, my brother came from the living room. And came into the kitchen so it's just the three of us hugging and i'm in the middle crying because i fell off the treadmill <laughs> oh my gosh this is so embarrassing um but yeah that is basically the end of the story um <laughs> i hope you guys found it entertaining but i also did want to tell the story time just because so many embarrassing things that happen in the gym and i fell off the treadmill twice in front of everyone and you just literally we move baby we move we move we move but these things happen so if you're thinking about trying a new workout or a new exercise in the gym you're, you're a bit scared thinking you're not going to do it right or it's going to be embarrassing and you don't want people looking at you just think of me laying on the floor <laughs> literally even if you do something embarrassing people will laugh like in that moment and then go on about that about their day is not that deep so just try something new i really do hope you guys enjoyed the story time and i'll see you guys in the next video